Hey guys, what is up? My name is Tech Justin, and this is now another back-to-back -back episode for the Dozacraft Feed the Beast modded server. This is episode number four now, I believe, and um, we did get a key, so we are going to be jumping into another room and seeing what uh, that happens to bring us. So let's see what goes down here, huh? What are you gonna open now, huh? What are you gonna open now, redneck? Gonna check out the. Oh, I think he's listening. Listening. Doing the old Indian trick with the ear against the ground, except he's doing his ear against the door to make sure that it's safe. Cause I'll tell you what, that guardian one he thought was safe, I got wrecked right at the beginning. I got, I got, I got just hammered too. Oh. Oh, that was a waste of a key. <laughs> oh crap. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Priceless. <laughs> I am so glad I got that on video. <laughs> oh. mm. <laughs> so I think we got another star. Um No sure don't <laughs> Well, we can try the sacrifice. Yeah, sacrifice thing now. <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. <laughs> He's got a lot of stuff, so I wonder if he if he he does have everything that we're gonna need or not. Um. I think he might want to have a silk touch to get some of that cursed earth. Which I don't blame him. Because that cursed earth is pretty sweet. I, I would almost want to get some of it too. I think I, I think um, I might try and con some off of him. If at all possible. Come on, guitar. I climbed in a bed. You can get in. There we go. Um, he's gonna try to get some cursed earth.
About to get a bunch of string. How are you planning on getting a bunch of string? Yep, because you can, uh, as long as you have, if you have multiple sigils in your inventory at that time, whenever you do the ritual, it will activate every sigil that you have on you. <coughs> so we can actually activate um, his and ours. Oh, he says he's got it. Sweet. Set it up. <laughs> Put the cursed earth in SBs. You know, you could have made everyone a jetpack. <laughs> it costs a lot. Yeah, I know. I know. That's why I don't have one. <laughs> ah. I know. I'm just jelly because you got one. <laughs> okay, so where are we doing this at? Here looks good. Oh yeah, we probably want to try and keep a good distance away. Doop 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 doop. Maybe we got some clay. I'm gonna need some of that. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna mine that right now. Because we will need clay for the Tinker's Construct Smeltery. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna have to wait for the night time to fall. <clears throat> do I have the net? Sure do. Here we go. Here we go. Let's do this. Oh! 
<laughs> I got creepered. Six Z nine thirty eight Y sixty seven. Come on! Oh, it is almost time. Oh! Oh. oh, it happened. It happened. There it is. I need... I need my gravestone. Eat that carrot. Eat the carrot. Oh, get away, get away, get away, get away, get away. Give me my stuff. Oh, man. Dude, I'm... It's... Uh, I missed the whole thing. I missed the whole thing. Thanks. Stupid fallen knight had to kill me. And then a spider. Come on. Come on. Get away from me. Hand me to... 
This is hard. Yeah, it's hard, dude. I I died. This is this is unfair. Let's see if he's got to have some food or something that I can eat. No food, really? Oh man. That cactus fruit. Can I eat you? Sure can. Come on, come on, come on, come on. <clears throat> I want my stuff back. Oh, he got blown up by a creeper. Come on. Come on. Oh, Fallen Knights, stay away from me. And Fallen Knights are some tough sons of bitches. Oh, now it's all going to start setting on fire. I don't need none of that. Oh, come on. No, oh, come on. Oh. I need to go back to the base and get a uh, sword and then some food and then uh, I might stand a fighting chance when I go over there and actually try and get my gravestone back. That fallen knight got me at the worst time. Well, either way, we we, we kind of have a better idea of how to do it so that we can actually do it ourselves when the time comes. And then this way you guys can see it. <coughs> this way you guys can see it um, firsthand.
Come on, come on, come on. At least it's easy to find. Just follow the fire. <laughs> Rednecks over there having a heck of a time. Oh, yeah, I killed. Well, at least there's no more stuff. So now we're able to actually get our things back. And we do have some dirt so we can put out all this fire. Oh. Okay, which is cool because that means that we're actually saving some of this cursed earth here too, so that, that way we're able to get some of it. Because I, d I would definitely want some. It'd be great for a mob spawner using some of this cursed earth. Get some more dirt here. There we go. Got a witch right there. Got her. Okay, we'll put one there. We'll break you, put you right there. Break you, put you right there. I got it. All patched up.
Um, I think it is. Well, guys, either way, um, we got to see a little bit of it before we kept having to run back and forth from our timely demise, which, of course, obviously ruined it. But either way, you know, like we said, um, um, we will be able to um, do it ourselves, hopefully in the near future, um, so that you guys can get a better view of what it's like doing it firsthand. Um, but until then, uh, I'm going to wrap up this episode. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and if you enjoyed watching this video, do me a favor and hit a like. That would be sweet. And also, if this is the first time that you are uh, watched the video on my channel, subscribe for more daily Minecraft and gaming videos. But until then, peace. quite well. I'm not, I'm not sure how long um, anybody else has been on the base. Ooh, elevator. Oh, I didn't even notice that when I was up there. Nope, not yet. Um,